Hi, I'm James Hagedorn from the Denver Museum of Nature and Science. I'm down here near Colorado Springs doing some field work on some very special rocks. These rocks are pretty soft, so instead of using a rock hammer today, I'm using a spade from our garden. And one of the things we're doing is we're coming over to these rocks and trying to figure out what they can tell us about when they were deposited and where they were deposited. In the, this case, behind me, you'll see some rocks that are striped. We've got a, a black layer of this rock here, a white layer in this rock here, and another black layer abo above it. It's almost like this Oreo cookie. And these black layers were deposited in an ancient swamp or pond in which plant material built up, forming this coal-like layer. That's how the layer above it formed as well. But this white stuff in the middle, that's the good stuff. Because it turns out that this horizon right here was the ash that fell down from a giant volcano and landed in this ponded swamp-like setting.